Imagine a world with endless clean energy, no pollution, no greenhouse gases. This isn't science fiction, it's the promise of fusion energy. Fusion, the process that powers the sun, has been a dream for scientists for decades. Now, a recent breakthrough brings us closer to this reality, but what exactly is fusion energy? And why is this recent development such a big deal? Fusion energy has the potential to revolutionize how we power our lives. Unlike fossil fuels, it doesn't produce harmful emissions or dangerous waste. Scientists have managed to create a reaction that produces more energy than it consumes. Let's begin our journey into the world of fusion energy. Fusion energy combines two light atomic nuclei to form a heavier nucleus, releasing tremendous energy. It's the same reaction that powers the sun and stars. When hydrogen nuclei fuse to form helium, energy is released as light and heat. Fusion fuel, isotopes of hydrogen like deuterium and tritium, can be extracted from water and lithium. This means we have an almost infinite supply of fuel for fusion reactions. Fusion energy is incredibly efficient, yielding millions of times more energy than chemical reactions. Despite its potential, achieving fusion energy on Earth has proven extremely difficult. The conditions required for fusion reactions are extreme, involving high temperatures and pressures. But understanding these challenges is key to appreciating the recent breakthrough in fusion research. This breakthrough represents a critical step in mimicking the sun's process here on Earth. The sun achieves fusion naturally due to its immense gravity and high temperatures. At its core, the sun's temperature reaches about 15 million degrees Celsius. This intense heat gives hydrogen atoms enough energy to overcome their natural repulsion and fuse together. Recreating these conditions on Earth is no small feat. To achieve fusion, we need temperatures around 100 million degrees Celsius. Scientists use methods like magnetic confinement and inertial confinement to achieve these temperatures. Magnetic confinement involves using powerful magnetic fields to contain the plasma. Devices like tokamaks and stellarators are designed for this purpose. Inertial confinement uses lasers to compress a small pellet of fusion fuel to extremely high densities and temperatures. The recent breakthrough involves advancements in these techniques, bringing us closer to achieving a stable and self-sustaining fusion reaction. The recent breakthrough in fusion energy marks a historic moment in scientific research. For the first time, scientists have achieved a fusion reaction that produces more energy than it consumes. This milestone is often referred to as net positive energy. Researchers at the National Ignition Facility used powerful lasers to compress a tiny pellet of hydrogen fuel, resulting in a net positive energy gain. Similarly, Experiments with tokamaks have shown significant progress in maintaining stable plasma for longer durations. Achieving net positive energy proves that fusion energy is not just a theoretical possibility, but a practical reality. This success has sparked excitement and optimism in the scientific community and beyond. It demonstrates that with further research and development, fusion energy could become a viable source of clean, sustainable power. The implications of this breakthrough are profound paving the way for future advancements in fusion technology. However, there are still challenges to overcome before fusion can become a mainstream energy source. Achieving net positive energy in fusion research is a monumental milestone. This means the energy produced by the fusion reaction is greater than the energy required to sustain it. It's a critical step toward making fusion energy a practical power source. Previously, the energy input needed was greater than the output. The recent breakthrough shows net positive energy gain is possible. This validates the principles behind fusion energy. It opens the door to further research and development. Achieving net positive energy boosts confidence in fusion's potential. While significant, this milestone is not the end of the journey. There are still challenges to overcome before large-scale deployment. One of the most compelling benefits of fusion energy is its sustainability. Fusion energy offers a nearly limitless source of power. The primary fuels for fusion deuterium and tritium are abundant. Deuterium can be extracted from seawater, while tritium can be bred from lithium. This abundance of fuel means that fusion energy has the potential to meet the world's energy needs for thousands of years. Fusion energy is also highly efficient, yielding millions of times more energy than chemical reactions. Another aspect of sustainability is the minimal environmental impact of fusion energy. Unlike fossil fuels, fusion does not produce greenhouse gases or other harmful emissions. Additionally, 
fusion reactors do not produce long-lived radioactive waste, unlike nuclear fission reactors. Overall, the sustainability of fusion energy makes it a promising solution to the world's energy challenges. Fusion energy stands out for its minimal environmental impact. Unlike fossil fuels, fusion does not produce harmful emissions. This means no carbon dioxide, no methane, and no other greenhouse gases that contribute to global warming. In addition to the absence of greenhouse gas emissions, fusion energy produces very little waste. The primary byproduct of fusion reactions is helium, an inert gas that is harmless to the environment. This is in stark contrast to nuclear fission, which produces radioactive waste that can remain hazardous for thousands of years. The short-lived radioactive waste from fusion reactors can be managed safely, reducing long-term environmental and health risks. Another environmental advantage of fusion energy is its reduced impact on natural resources. Unlike fossil fuels, which require extensive mining and drilling, the fuels for fusion, deuterium and tritium, are readily available and can be extracted with minimal environmental disruption. The minimal environmental impact of fusion energy makes it an attractive option for sustainable development. Safety is another major advantage of fusion energy. Fusion reactions are inherently safer than fission reactions, which are used in current nuclear power plants. In a fusion reactor, the conditions required for the reaction are extremely difficult to maintain. If something goes wrong, the reaction simply stops. This is different from fission reactors, where a malfunction can lead to a catastrophic meltdown. Fusion energy also avoids the issue of long-lived radioactive waste. While fusion reactions do produce some radioactive materials, these materials have much shorter half-lives than the waste from fission reactors. Additionally, fusion reactors do not use materials that can be easily weaponized, reducing the risk of nuclear proliferation. Fusion reactions require precise conditions to occur, including extremely high temperatures and pressures. The safety of fusion energy makes it an appealing option for widespread use. Despite the recent breakthrough, there are still significant challenges to be addressed before fusion energy can become a practical reality. One of the main challenges is achieving a stable fusion reaction over long periods. While scientists have managed to achieve net positive energy, maintaining these conditions consistently and reliably is still a work in progress. Stability is crucial for the continuous operation of fusion reactors. Another challenge is the cost of fusion research and development. Building and maintaining fusion reactors requires significant financial investment. The materials and technologies needed to create and sustain the extreme conditions for fusion are expensive. Additionally, the infrastructure required to support fusion energy, including power plants and distribution networks, needs to be developed. The scalability of fusion energy is also a concern. Addressing these challenges will require continued research, investment and collaboration among scientists, engineers, policymakers, and industry leaders. The future outlook for fusion energy is promising. The recent breakthrough in achieving net positive energy is a significant step forward. Continued research and development are essential to making fusion energy practical. Improving the efficiency and stability of fusion reactions is crucial. This involves refining magnetic and inertial confinement techniques. Advances in materials science will develop more efficient reactor components. Developing scalable fusion reactors is another key focus. Designing reactors to meet global energy demand is essential. Addressing regulatory and policy issues is also crucial. The journey to harnessing fusion energy is far from over, but we are closer than ever before. In conclusion, the recent breakthrough in fusion energy marks a significant milestone in the quest for a sustainable and clean source of power. Fusion energy, which mimics the process that powers the sun, has the potential to revolutionize how we generate and use energy. Achieving net positive energy is a major step forward, demonstrating that fusion energy is not just a theoretical possibility, but a practical reality. The benefits of fusion energy are numerous. It offers a nearly limitless source of power with abundant and efficient fuel. Fusion energy is also environmentally friendly, producing minimal waste and no greenhouse gases. The inherent safety of fusion reactions adds to its appeal as a future energy source. However, there are still challenges to overcome. Achieving stable and continuous fusion reactions, reducing costs, and developing the necessary infrastructure are all critical areas that require further research and investment. 
The path ahead is challenging, but the promise of fusion energy makes it a journey worth undertaking.